Have you ever wondered what happens when you swallow a pill with a soft drink, coffee, juice, or milk? Does it make any difference to how the pill works or how your body reacts? Is it safe or harmful to do so? Hello and welcome to Curiosity, where we explore fascinating and interesting topics about everything. Today we are going to talk about something that many of us do without thinking twice. Taking pills with soda or other drinks. First of all, let's understand what a pill is and how it works. A pill is a solid form of medicine that contains one or more active ingredients that are designed to treat a specific condition or symptom. When you swallow a pill, it travels down your esophagus and reaches your stomach, where it starts to dissolve and release its contents. Then, the dissolved medicine enters your bloodstream through your intestines and reaches the target organs or tissues where it exerts its effects. However, not all pills dissolve at the same rate or in the same way. Some pills have special coatings that prevent them from dissolving in the stomach and make them dissolve only in the intestines. This is done to protect the medicine from being destroyed by the stomach acid or to avoid irritating the stomach lining. Other pills have extended release formulations that make them dissolve slowly over time and release their medicine gradually. This is done to maintain a steady level of medicine in the blood and avoid peaks and troughs. So, what happens when you take a pill with something other than water? Well, it depends on what you are taking and what you are drinking. Some beverages can interfere with how the pill dissolves, how it is absorbed, or how it interacts with other substances in your body. Let's look at some examples. Soft drinks or aerated beverages are carbonated and acidic. They can decrease the antibacterial action of some medicines and cause allergies or adverse effects in some people. They can also reduce the absorption of iron, so if you are taking iron supplements or medicines with iron, you should avoid taking them with soft drinks. Juices and other drinks can also affect how medicines work. For instance, grapefruit juice can inhibit an enzyme that helps break down many drugs, such as cholesterol-lowering drugs, blood pressure drugs, and erectile dysfunction drugs. This can lead to higher levels of these drugs in your blood and increase the risk of side effects. Other juices, such as orange juice or cranberry juice, can alter the pH of your urine and affect how some drugs are excreted from your body. Coffee and tea contain caffeine and tannins that can also interact with some medicines. Caffeine can increase the effects of some stimulants, such as painkillers, antidepressants, or asthma medications. It can also reduce the effects of some sedatives, such as sleeping pills or antihistamines. Tannins can bind to some drugs and make them less available for absorption. For example, tannins can reduce the absorption of antibiotics, antifungals, or antimalarials. Milk and dairy products contain calcium and proteins that can also interfere with some medicines. Calcium can bind to some drugs and form insoluble complexes that are not absorbed by the body. For example, calcium can reduce the absorption of antibiotics, such as tetracyclines or fluoroquinolones. Proteins can affect how some drugs are metabolized by the liver or how they bind to proteins in the blood. For example, proteins can increase the metabolism of warfarin, a blood thinner, and decrease its effectiveness. So, as you can see, taking pills with different beverages can have different consequences for your health and well-being. Some of these consequences may be minor or negligible, but others may be serious or even life-threatening. That's why it is always advisable to take pills with water unless your doctor or pharmacist tells you otherwise. Water is the best beverage to take pills with because it does not interfere with how pills dissolve, how they are absorbed, or how they interact with other substances in your body. Water also helps flush out any residues or impurities that may be left behind by the pills or the beverages. Water also helps prevent dehydration, which can affect how your body processes medicines. Of course, there may be situations where you don't have access to water or you prefer to take pills with something else for personal reasons. In that case, you should always check the label of your medicine or consult your doctor or pharmacist before taking pills with any other beverage. They can tell you if there are any specific instructions or warnings for your medicine and what beverages are safe or unsafe to take it with. The bottom line is, taking pills with soda or other drinks is not a good idea unless you know what you are doing and what risks you are taking. Water is always the best option for taking pills safely and effectively. That's all for today's episode. Thank you for watching Curiosity.
If you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe for more content like this. And don't forget to share your thoughts and questions in the comments below. Until next time, stay curious.